stop playing with him. Jada Vinci and his bitch. Okay. I'm so bad I got him twerking with me. So your eyeshadow bitch. looks like this. You literally have somewhere to go and you're like, fuck, I can't wipe this off. I'm a terrible makeup artist. You wanna know how to fix this? I'm gonna show you guys right now. My bitch driver all white, right? Couldn't hit it if you niggas had I Lanes can't call and you lame. You had it and you lost all the shine. Open up the safe, bitches got a lot to say. Pussy in your face, had to put you in your place. Seven letters on the plate, fuck you in the break. I got calls, I got bags, I got real estate. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jay Da Vinci. If you're new, be sure to hit that subscribe button. If you've already been watching my videos, what's up y'all, welcome to another video. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys how to fix your makeup when you like mess up, but you don't have no time to fix it. And I mean, I think that that's like half of us. You guys, don't forget to give it a big old thumbs up, comment, subscribe for future videos, and let's get right into it. I've got a few new products that I'm gonna be using. Um, some of them I've been, I used on my wedding, and I mean, I danced all night long, and I had such a great time. So those are like now really some of my favorite products. Oh, and if you are new to my videos, I can't talk and do my brows. I'm not multi-talented like that. Yeah, depending on how I'm feeling, it goes the brow, you know? It's never really a set brow. It's like, what is today? How do you feel today? <laughs> Those are the brows. been loving to use on my face is this YSL. It's called the Blur Primer. The YSL Blur Primer, you guys, you guys. I'm actually not gonna put it all over my face yet because I'm gonna do my eye area first, but I do want to um, concealer on my face. And you guys, this just makes my face just feel so smooth, so smooth, like literally. Smooth like butter, like baby's ass. Smooth, like smooth. I'm gonna go in with my NARS. I love using NARS in the color. Ginger is what I'm using to line my brows. And I do wanna use my Anastasia Beverly Hills Subculture Palette today. I haven't used it in a minute and I can't talk and do this. Okay. Okay. It's a spider. Okay. okay. I don't know what it's about to do. So we're gonna pretend like it's date night. We're gonna go on a date. Because oh, why not? Oh. Okay. So what we're gonna do now, I'm gonna go in with my subculture palette. This is what we're gonna use to do our makeup today. Specific look that I'm going for in mind. I think we should start off with this new wave. This new wave is kind of like an orange vibe. We'll just go for it. I don't have any base on my lid. And straight off the back, we are chalky. So this color is really chalky. I don't have any primer or anything on my lid. It's that purple shade. We're gonna just bring that into the little outside crease area. We are experiencing a bit of fallout. So I'm really just taking that all-star color and I'm just um, tapping it into the lens. Uh, and we're gonna go in with that shade New Wave, which was that orange shade we originally did, and just blend out the edges. A mess, huh? We're gonna go in with an empty brush. It's just like this is wiping all over the place. <laughs> 
You guys, I don't know if it's because I didn't use a base, but this is a mess. Like, let's just cut our crease. This is a mess. So I'm gonna just add this all star back to the crease and then I'm gonna just cut the crease. Cause this is a mess. Literally, it's a full mess. So your eyeshadow looks like this and you, you, you literally have somewhere to go and you're like, fuck, I can't wipe this off. I'm a terrible makeup artist. You wanna know how to fix this? I'm gonna show you guys right now. So like, first let's just pack it on there, just so it's like hella blended. And I'm gonna just add it to the mess because I mean, it's already a mess, but let's just make sure that this mess is like a perfect mess. I know, I know you're in a rush and this is your first date. Now he's gonna not really like me. <laughs> I got you girl. So, all right, so now that we're here, Complete mess. We even got a little Cleopatra going on over here. We're gonna start by just blending out any harsh lines. And I know that there, I know you got harsh lines. If you've resulted this far and we look like this, there's got to be harsh lines. Um, and this eyeshadow in particular isn't really sticking. We're gonna take a concealer brush. This one is from NARS in particular. If I had an even lighter one, I would go on with that. But right now this is going to work. We are going to take our concealer brush and add a line, like a little spot to our eye. Just like that and then we're gonna look up and like look all over the place. So we can know where that line is going, okay? So you guys can see where it is. We can even take some more concealer. carving ourselves a cut crease. Cause we gotta finish, we gotta fix what we broke. How to save your eyes from mishap. Your face too, I'm gonna F the face up and we're gonna fix the face. So this is gonna be makeup 911 help. So you can watch this video if you know your eyes are starting to look crazy and you just don't have the time to fix it. I'm, a, I'm about to help you. but I'm gonna just take this Dawn shade and put it all over my lid. I'm actually gonna do half Dawn and then half Roxy. I know it might look like a mess, but just trust the process. Blend it out of it. So I'm gonna just take my Stila glitter glue, wipe it on the back of my hand, and then I'm gonna use this to make like a little cut crease indentation on my actual eyebrow. Okay, so I guess for today's eyeliner, I'm gonna use the Maybelline. Loving the YSL Blur Primer. 
Um, I would say if your makeup isn't really sticking onto your face, you gotta have to find out if the primer that you're using is actually any good for you. Um, this primer in particular, it's super soft. Literally, my fit, my skin feels like, I don't know, like it's literally so soft. When I say so soft, I mean so soft. For my foundation, I've actually been loving the Becca Ultimate Coverage 24 Hour Foundation. This is in the shade Amber or 22, but I've literally been loving this foundation. Squeeze like two pumps behind my hand and then I'll literally apply it all over my face. Like this is really full coverage, but I like a flawless, flawless skin. Like I like to literally look flawless. Then I'm gonna go in with my handy dandy Morphe sponge, which I've been loving. And then I'm gonna just dab it into the skin. If it ever starts looking a bit patchy to me, I'll just go in with a bit more conceal, I mean, a bit more foundation, and um, there's nothing wrong with that. All right, so for my concealer, I've actually been loving the Tarte Shape Tape. I use the color tan, and it's like really full coverage, high coverage. Uh, I set it with the Ben Nye, but it's so full coverage. Yeah, I really like it. I only like to put it under my eyes. I'm gonna show you guys because when I was putting it on my forehead, it was just too much. Got down the bridge. That's really it, like that much on my forehead. Put it on my chin. And I don't bring it right there. Okay, so that's like literally all the places that I've been adding this concealer. And it's only because it's like really full coverage, so you don't need that much. Under the eye. Just can get this as straight as we can get it. Okay, so what we're gonna do next, we're gonna go in with a bit of contour, just like a bit. And we'll just blend it in. And then I'm kind of just going in like circular motions. All right, so we're gonna take our Ben Nye setting powder to set the under eyes. Oh. True Complexions Contour Palette. Y'all know that I really like this palette. But uh, yeah, we're gonna set the sides of our jawlines. Gonna bring it down the side to bake the sides. What's gonna happen now, we're gonna take our Cover FX powder, it's our handy dandy Cover FX powder, and then we're gonna just begin dusting everything off. which of course is Almoretto. Then we're gonna just go on with a bit of the pink. Spritz our face. Wet our face down. We're gonna have to debate on what kind of uh, look we want on the bottom lid. I think we'll just go for like an orange vibe. And this um, Lancome mascara, Jesus, it's waterproof. Okay, so now we just need some highlight on the bridge of our nose. Let's just put on Girlfriend by Huda Beauty. So I'm gonna just take down my pen curls. I need my bag quicker. you guys enjoyed my tips if you mess up and you don't know what else to do with your makeup this is gonna save your life don't forget to give this video a big old thumbs up like comment subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed and you made it this far you clearly love it and I love you join the fam and I'll see you guys next time bye